Come back. I don't like the words come back, Josh, but um, let's say return to action um, tonight here in Liverpool. Um, I, th I thought in my pre fight hype build up, um, we would mention the words he's going to take what happened in London a couple of weeks ago out on the opponent. I think I counted 16 or 17 uppercuts um, about half a minute before the, the stoppage came. Um, I think that was show that I don't always talk shit. And, um, <laughs> it wasn't just promoter talk. He, he, I don't think that was your command either. But you tell me in a minute, maybe I'm wrong. But um, I've never seen that many uppercuts thrown at that speed. Actually, I want to go back and check whether I was right in my 17. But um, it was fantastic to have Josh back in the room. He saw, um, you know, the the movement. Um, it actually, for me, in, even in between the rounds, you were getting, you saw the, the rust almost come off for, yeah. before our eyes, and then the timing was getting better, and then and obviously led to the stoppage. Um, but for us, it's just fantastic uh, to have him back. Activity is the key now. Um, July 30th, Newcastle. Um, looking forward to a, a Northeast takeover. And, um, you know, it was a, it was a was a very successful evening. I think ticked all the boxes that we wanted, and we move, we move, and, and we roll on. Um, maybe before Josh says something, Adam, uh, how did you find it from the corner? Just a relief to get him back in. Did you plan the 17 uppercuts? No, it was 15. He 15, just added a couple of them. It was a relief to get him back in the ring <laughs> after over 460 days out, and to get the first one out of the way is a relief. And 161. Yeah, it was nice to get back in there. Josh, how did you feel it after 460.5 days out the ring? How did you find it to be back in that beautiful squared circle? Well, like you said, I felt like the rust has fallen off each round. Um, it did feel like that because you can spar as much as you, can, as you want. You can feel good in sparring and training as hard as you'd like to, but nothing ever replicates fight night, getting ready for it, everything, the changing rooms going away to hotel rooms, everything like that, nothing replicated, so to, like you said, round after round I just felt as though my time was coming back and I started reading them a lot better, round after round, I wanted to put a statement out there with a jab, I wanted to get my jab out there because I know my jab, my jab is a weapon, so using it well tonight and it's it just softened them up and eventually brought them down to where he was taking probably a few too many shots. Yeah, and was it something you dreamt about last night to get him out there with an uppercut or what, what led to that how do, how do you remember like those 10-15 uh, seconds in the corner when you just wouldn't stop throwing an uppercut I, I, I was saying I was saying to a lot of people not a lot of people but I was just saying Adam um, during during this week I was going I'm going to land the right uppercut on this guy you know? and he was going alright 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 I said no, I'm going to land the right uppercut on him he's going okay just break him down with your jab first I said yeah but that right uppercut I'm going to land on him so then when he started landing and he started doing his job I thought well if you're going to just sit there and take it then I'm just going to just keep giving you it you know what I mean so mm. it's, it, but credit to him he's a tough fella he goes, he goes the distance normally where heavier lands as well like super middleweights and middleweights so for, it put a, to hurt him because he, he was physically shook shows what Strength and power and carry up the one five four. Yeah. Okay. Um, I mean, I think we've we've stated everything there is to state for tonight. And you like the uppercut? I love the uppercut. You seem to like the uppercut. You know, every, we love a show real uppercut. You know. Um, I'd say let's let's break it that. And do some one on ones. If there's anything else to to add to it. No. Um, I think the, I'll let the gentleman stand up and you can. Have your words. Yeah, Thank you very much.